Yeah. People look for where I eat. Good morning. So my friend then prepare for me when I come to Jamaica. We don't pay for food, right? We are friends. We don't pay for food. See my friend there. See him. If you don't want to pay for food, you don't just come cool down. You don't have to pay for food. <laughs> Alright, so you know the bag, right? Ring the doorbell and see if nobody there. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. Yeah, man. What happened is just, just put the tent tent on it. And then it will wrap. No, 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 twist it now. Yeah. And you put the key back and, uh, and shuffle the cord, yeah. I like a Airbnb. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to Jamaica, everyone. This is your captain speaking. Brandy, girls, them candy. So big up to Sandy. Hey, this is Jamaica Good Life. It's not a cool life. Right now, walking on the beach. The heat is good for your system. Today is Wednesday. Today we're working from the beach today. Regular work from Jamaica procedure. The charges are there. The uh, fruits are there. So this is what it's like working from Jamaica in Montego Bay. Now I'm gonna tell you guys already why I love Moby because of this beach. Security. So when you can see family on Wednesdays. Big man, how come you not go, how come they not go and work on school? No Wednesday? Everybody, no work on school there for the. How come, how come you not there work? Hey? I mean one for there, so. How come everybody not go and work? Yeah, work. Are you working? Are you taking your baby? Yeah. You stay home? Yeah, I mean, I know I stay with nobody, so. Mm -hmm. I need nothing. So, how are you working at night? Or are you just, you just stay to the baby? Yeah. No, my mother, when the kind of look, you know. How oh, old the baby is? Nice man. You know, say two years me take care of my baby. Alright. Ah, the best thing in life a yeah, man yeah. could have done. You know, I you know, have no problem to stay with the baby. Because here, the baby wants to say, well, if my baby is going to be in No. How much am I paying that? How much am I paying that? You know, I'm going to take some food or work and pay what? I'm looking for me and say, no, wait, no, sis, because I guess so. You see how you take care of the baby? Mm -hmm. I saw them grow. I saw them grow. We have been time and time. I was young, we were miserable. I have to know how to deal with it. So I'm going to make it 10 9 pumpers and shave for you. Good, good. For me, 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 Big man. Yeah, 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 man. I don't know if you have a mother So anyway, I don't know if you have a suck up I don't know if you have a suck up I don't know if you have a suck up Okay, so I love that The beach is nice man If you have a mother come from a long time Yeah 
I mean, I mean, still a stick on for it, I'll go to him, man. I'll dress him top, so. Maybe I cook Irish. Him sound big, man, already. Sardine or Irish potato? Yeah, yeah. Eat sardine? Yeah. Uh, 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 pumpkin? Mm -hmm. Banana. And carrot? Yeah, you mash it with butter soup. in it? Yeah. It's why I make soup here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gin can be <laughs> built. <laughs> make our TV. You know what I mean? You say my nine months? Mm -hmm. I write big food. Yeah, I make, 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 make TV. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fever grass tea. Yes. Now where you make black meat. Right. And you don't take it? No, I take it. You shall last cup. Mm -hmm. No, I take it. Let me say you have be a tropical uh, insurance in Tropical Tropical regime. Okay. So I'm going to give my peanuts punches with everything. Good on them, baby. Okay, so make sure you keep it light with like arrowroot. Mm -hmm. You see arrowroot powder? Go to the supermarket with arrowroot powder. Yeah. Because that's not sugary, but it's a baby food like that. Yeah. Blend, uh, blender. And stinking toto. Look at it as stinking toto powder with arrowroot. You see me? Um, but make sure enough pumpkin, carrot, blend it out. What about papa? Papa, because it's a little insurance. This morning, well, this morning, give one to me. I know, say, I post me a give baby, and I say, I'm going to give you a bite of it to me. But I don't want to get to the news, I'm going to give baby for a minute. Bite up, 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 I have a good life. I have a good life. But this really helped make more set more beef on our path, you know? Yeah. People love the beach. What it, so they're killing us, so what else? Well at least one part good, eh? A girl said, I said, she didn't come over here because there too much demons there. I said, you can't answer that. Then the baby is there too. Yeah. Eh? I'm going to go to Africa one day. 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 See that look on the look on the place man, look on the nice black people. Man. Lovely. Give thanks for brother. People, I'ma show you how it how it do workings. This is Jamaica, good life. Not a, you see how the people live. This is this how we work in Jamaica. People you have to just make life where you can't make it, you know. If you get something off, you just take it, you know. You so life going on, you're one step at a time. Don't put one toe before the other. See how we work here. The umbrella and thing. So you now, about the food, I bring the water, see? I'm going to go beach, you know. When we're working in Jamaica, you know. I'm going to show them my lunch. So I want to know where I do the thing. Upswing, outside. You have to have a knife on your papa for lunch and you have to cut up some fruits and that is lunch which is right So come on out the chicken and you never invite me Next time Alright Which is right <laughs> Next time I deal with the chicken which is right you see the thing with like, well, Jamaica, you can talk to everybody. The whole country have a vibe. So I'm going to take a dip in the ocean. This is lunch or is this? What is this? Food. Hey, what time is it? Hmm? What time is it? A sun, mom, sun. What time is it? No, let's see. So brunch. Yeah. So basically people, let's bless up the table. 
Give thanks. All right. <laughs> Shanti Sprite of the universe. People, this is Jamaica. Good life. This is what it's like living in Jamaica. We're trying to show you the different side from the YouTube side with the crime. Can I show you the neighborhood? But we can't show you the pepper. <laughs> and you guys know me love the pepper and the onion. So this is how much me eating from the one. Fish, pepper spice. I cut out my chicken, I cut out the chicken. Every month or so, I will indulge. Because the Jamaica health box, my pre-diabetic gone, I eat burger now, never rice again. As a matter of fact, I will pepper lick you. <laughs> if I go to a restaurant, I might just cook the burger. And I did here. I'm bringing it with me. <laughs> you know, a little hey, hey. container hat. I'm going to get something I can deal with the um, the bulldog and keep it hot. I'm thermos. I'm a kind of rice. The rice is not good for the diabetes. So if I'm going to get the bulldog, please get it. So we got, I'm over 50 now. Now 50.00001. Um, every time when I see me eat, it is my Earth Strong celebration. I celebrate for a whole year. So the Tarian race, we take over the whole place now. Now I'm half a century. What does it mean for me to be half a century? I've done enough work for my people creating this program. So I struggle along the way, you know, some people is what it is. But red onions every day with pepper, and pepper get the parasites out the stomach, and the bulgur. So if you eat like this every day, next day your salad. We'll pay five thousand dollars for that fish, you know. It was big and fresh. Sure from the seaside now over there. Mango for a tree every day. So, for people who want to live this life, turn off YouTube, <laughs> sell some of your assets, and wherever you see a good community, it's going to get better. Because people now buy a house for left it in Jamaica, and property is so expensive. So, whatever you do in abroad, my top choice is Montego Bay. Why? Harmony Park. One hour from the grill. I don't want to come back to Jamaica to live without ocean. Makes no sense. We live in New York so long. We need ocean. Um, safety. Mobile. Quick access to you. Harkai. King Alarm. Hospitals, mobile. Because it's a tourist capital, you get in the best of both worlds. Transportation, no problem. Road quality, up and running. Shopping and the ambience of America and, and Jamaica, it's a balance. Like you never really left America. You can deliver food to your house, vegetable, mobile. Now, Downside, it's hot. So you need solar panels in your life. And you need water catchment to water your, your own vegetable. Food is expensive. But you can't get your food from the country. Why well, I love Mobile now, I've traveled. Um, the mosquito count is low. Because it's hot, you dry up any water that's on the ground. Um, the neighborhoods them are developed and security is strong 
I could ride my bike to the wharf, I could ride my bike to the seaside and fish. Fish is the freshest. So when you retire, you want to get a boat. You want to learn how to set your own catchment. Simple maths. Your fishing license six thousand dollars. Why I love my beer? I'm gonna have my fishing license. I can set my own pot, which I intend to do. I could bike to the fisherman and say, the beach, bike to Harmony Park. You know, some ever need some more work than I know. <laughs> when you're done, bike to Harmony Park. You know, so we never seen much flies when we come all of a sudden. I don't give a fly swatter. They want the good life. They want fly, fly want the good life too. Because this is all we are showing up people. We're not showing up. We, we turn off TV, turn off YouTube. I'm pumping my bicycle tire. I'm not process nothing in the world. 50 years I'm on earth. I have to think as much positive as I can for so I don't get cancer. Because if you think negative, you become it, right? So here's this mental first. So, if I said Jamaica health box, I'm supposed to demonstrate to you guys that I'm getting healthy. The fermentation is working. The cleaning. I lost all the weight. I'm not going to start exercise. If we said Jamaica good life, it's also about the food. So instead of rice bulgur, if we eat the chicken, on the cook boat, we use the body cleanse. You see? You must always cleanse if you do something wrong. And you eat pickle with your food, good ketchup, or drink wine to ferment the meat. So right now we're eating fish. You're supposed to drink some wine or pickle. We're supposed to have pickle on it, so I have to buy pickle from the supermarket. You see what I'm saying? Pickle didn't need for the ass out. Or sauerkraut. Our kombucha, our baba roots, our better yet never tired roots from Jamaica. Good life. Or oh, never tired roots are 50 years in the business. So you must always have five buckle of never tired roots in your house. Five buckle of slippery elm. So the slippery elm coat the stomach. You see? Every day you must take moringa capsules. Every day. So we're gonna line up all the products when we eat for sure now what I do and how I'm gonna eat moving forward and I'm gonna transform into a healthier me because I'm 50 with no dis ease. And we give thanks. I mean we reach 50. I'm the Almighty teach me and make me meet people with no dis ease. So if them now live, we're gonna live for them. If them sick, we're going to show them health. Mm -hmm. And all my focus right now is health. The yam we get from Captain Jack, no fertilizer. So we'll find a farmer. We're we'll going to plant my own lettuce, my own carlo. I'm not trust nothing out of road. I'm spray. Sweet peppers. So when you're in Jamaica, most important thing, the gutter for your house, the tank, and solar pump connected to the pump. It is not the size of your house, it's the size of your water catchment. And the size of your farm, and the size of your land. And if you're not fed the land, you can lease something out of the country. But when you plant anything in Jamaica, fence it with bamboo and cement at the base. And steel fill up the cement at the top, the bamboo at the top. Don't waste no time upon the wall, but if you're doing farming in Jamaica, fence it first. <laughs> Don't spend the money and uh, get a vaxi. 10,000 max, 13,000, get a vaxi. I'm a link up so I have the people I'm secure in the car. If you want cameras, get the 8K Sentinel Defender camera. Def oh, watch the video again, Defender from BJ's. That camera detects human versus animals. So if a human is on your land, the camera will let you know, all right? So this is how you survive here. When you leave your house, turn off your water. Check the toilet then for leak and check the meter to see if the meter is counting. 
If it means you're sponging, your tiles are leaking. Okay? Don't leave your water on when you leave Jamaica. When you're building your house, create the architect of building. Build a big room with a bathroom. Do not complete the house until you complete the tank and plant all your trees. When you buy your land, you're supposed to have at least a five coconut tree, two pear tree. Pear tree is important. Breadfruit, mango, guava, these things. If you can't plant it on your land where your house is, please, people, I'm begging them to keep telling them. Food prices only going up. Most important tree in Jamaica, lime tree. And $900 for 12 lime right now. And vitamin C is paramount. If you don't want the orange connection, man, you become a member of Jamaica Good Life. You're not getting no contact without supporting the gas. I'm going to travel and do this program. Don't call me for nothing unless you, 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 you're not supporting the thing. Yeah? Good. So now, I years we are doing it in safety. And how were we safe? Um, the first thing in safety is share. Share what you have. Share food. Don't share money. And the first thing in safety in Jamaica is you have to test the people around you. You lose small, you test small. Sometime in Jamaica, there's nothing called cousins and family. There's something called money. So, the concept of family and cousin and thing is a hard thing to process. I like the burger when it, when it just like, like it. I like it when it stay like this. I don't like it when it's chill, I like it when it's soft. So, one thing I want to know, that cousin idea, a family thing, Build your own family. People you test and you have success. If you're doing any business with anybody, after six months, if you don't see progress with it, don't continue. Everybody have a story. And everybody have a one thing, money. If you're gonna date somebody, it's better you bring somebody in. Dating locally can become a sin because them say you have something. Yeah, it's it's best you find an expat community because most likely the expat community have the same mindset as you do. You know what I mean? They yeah. want safety here. They want companionship. Mm -hmm. They want it in kind of like the same order they had it in Sweet. where they were. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Queen. Build yourself a relationship with protection <laughs> and prepare for anything at any time. Jamaica, the ambulance not come quick, so have a first aid kit. <laughs> Send your GPS location to your family so they track you. Set up your cameras in your car. Sometimes you have to walk with your GoPro camera attached. It's a jungle out there, you know. So you have to be aware because it's a jungle out there. But don't invest all your money in Jamaica. But the bus for now. For the Ghana. I got one room with a family there. Do not invest all your eggs in one basket. Finish the one room first. You might not live in the house. <laughs> Tomorrow is not guaranteed. And in this advice advisory video, you better start eat right. <laughs> because all this hack steel and rice and talk about we only live once. <laughs> Randy's living twice. <laughs> I must cut out the rice. So what we say? <laughs> cut out the cow. I we select the pop chow. <laughs> if we eat the cow, we use the fermentation, which is the healing of the nation. So we so say we reduce the cow and we increase the pop chow. So now, 
Remember, you know, people, you can't go build a big house and then you have high blood pressure. <laughs> Dialysis. You know, since you work a foreign and just so stick with the bug and the fish, water, nothing much to it. Cut out the smoking. Go to jamaicahealthbox.com, sign up there. If you're over 35, we will clean you up. We're going to get you the blood, what do you think, I lose the weight, the blood purifier, the circulation tonic. The busy Vera cleanse for my kidney. If the, if the liver and the kidney not clean, look in your eyes, it look like you want visin. When the eyes is white, and sometimes even me tired and thing, because I'm not take my zinc. So the multivitamin and thing, I'm going to show you. I've gotten better and I'm learning and I'm going to share that knowledge. Mm -hmm. But the kidney and the liver and the blood purifier, no the detox. No Jamaicans think they know about herb. So them watch what good for what and them take it by themselves. Um, you need a complete system. You don't know everything. And get your glasses too. Check your eyes. Check your magnesium. We work with the experts. The blood pressure is not going to go down because of a herb. It's going to go down in how you eat, how you sleep, your whole lifestyle. So some of our clients, when did the blood pressure now in our work? Because you not sleep, you not breathe, you not exercise, not right. you not eat right, but you want to take some herb and but good. No. So now my pre-diabetic went away because of bulga. Exercise. Breathing. Sleeping. I will recommend with magic headset. <coughs> So after you reach 50, you know, it gets more difficult to be healthy and you have to cut out the cooking. So the only thing me like cook a steamed fish or burger. Only thing me like. Not like too much banana and yam. We like more chocha, cucumbers, water-based food, watermelon, above ground. Stay above ground. You know to say I walk? You're above ground. You see me? So why I eat so much thing underground? <laughs> you live underground? Mm -hmm. So, the arrowroot is a good underground. Spirulina, another water, dulse. We have something called aqua earth. You must put in your water every day. Give you the eleven herbs that you need. No, above ground. Onion, that's a great thing. You see more water base? So when you eat the things underground, make it water-based. You have not have too much water. Breadfruit is good above ground. Banana, good. Oops, but not too much I no. But the starch is, 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 is good, younger. No, sugar cane, natural, above ground. For the immune system. Yes, okra. Every day, if you can, because that's going to fix the gut. And if the okra fix the gut with the slippery elm, you see me, people. So now, when you go to JamaicaHealthBox.com, you buy five bucks of the slippery elm. Drink it for the month and see what happens to you. You slim down, you join them, your energy. Sometimes people buy one bottle for $20, but them service them care for $300. That don't make no sense. You can service your car, $300, what, every six months or so? Oh, 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 it's like every three months you have to service the car. Your panties them expensive, because you know, my fans don't know wear cheap panties. Is it what I said? $100 panties my viewers them wear. I know that. I know that they never sell me none, but I know for a fact. You see me? So what I said to you, Miss Auntie with your expensive panty. You better clean up your gut. You can't have expensive panty and go party with the big belly things that you're cute. Big belly not cute no more. Me used to have it and, me, and now me lose the big belly. You not cute. You not cute. The big belly have do do night. <laughs> Ten years. And at that cold and now start activating the cancer. So all I will look for them with dead of cancer, the gut. So get the super size starter box, Jamaica health box. And I'm not going to let you know everything. You don't. 
our experts are 50 years in the business. So we we'll have expensive panty coach and nice car. But star on the wake up. You need the roads. You need the sea. Jamaican people don't know so they must drink CMOS every day. Nothing can touch them if they drink CMOS, Perlina and Moringa and watercress every as often as possible. I eat a red onions every day. More sardine and salmon and salad. Cut out the cooking. Do it on the weekend. <laughs> You see me? Don't go to church and eat no macaroni and cheese and mucus that bonfire pan pasta. <laughs> when want to eat pork fine, you better have some fermentation like some roots or some pickle. You can't make the pasta I'll give you the word and I'll kill you at the same time. You see what I say? A war man, a war man, because my friend have stage 4 cancer. My friend have friend who have cancer now. Cancer. My family have anxiety. I want to cut back on the vinegar. Because vinegar is not going in the backyard. Process. So when you go in the stomach, stomach says, what is this? It's vinegar. Well, <laughs> it looks like man interruption. So then you start doing vinegar every day and the pH of the body start to change. And then your gut start get weak and you add ulcer. It's lemon, lemon water. Vinegar, okay, but I stay away from it. I give me chest burn. So even the fish, when woman them a clean fish, use lemon. Cut out the chemicals. Toothpaste use toms, right? The toms use. And um, what else? What else, my say? Give me some more health tip, Queen. Well, a lot of people don't realize too that your your state of mind mm -hmm. determines the state of your physical body. Mm -hmm. So if you're always stressed. You're always in anxiety, you're always in fear that manifests in how your body, you know, reacts to it. Because those things let off chemicals. Mm -hmm. And the constant chemicals in your body that your body don't need, that is not good for the body, mm -hmm. it causes dis ease mm -hmm. in the body too. Mm -hmm. So if you're in a stressful job, leave the stressful job. If you live in a stressful environment, mm -hmm. leave the stressful environment. If you want to come to Jamaica to come back to live, make the choice. Because it's all up to you. So Queen, you, you, you made the choice. Made Why the did choice. you make the choice? Because um, living in the States wasn't my, that, that, that wasn't my environment. That wasn't where I felt whole, you know, not that it was a bad life. I enjoyed the life up there, but I wasn't whole. I wasn't complete. What do you call whole? What is whole? Like what complete? What, is, what does complete mean? I was missing. Okay. I lived in, I've lived in New York for 10 years, lived in Georgia for 30 years. Wow. Um, New York chaotic for me. Didn't, couldn't manage that. My environment is an environment where there's constant sunshine, lots of sunshine, a growing season that's more than three to six months, mm -hmm. you know, because I like to grow things. Mm -hmm. I don't like to see my pepper plants die out mm -hmm. in October. Mm -hmm. I don't like to see my pumpkin plants die out in October. Yeah, yeah. It was depressing for me. And mm -hmm. then when the fall came, mm -hmm my body went through a changes of being depressed mm -hmm. literally mm -hmm. because then there was not the sun would go down in new york by 4 30. Mm -hmm. in georgia down. it's mm -hmm. gone down by five six o'clock mm -hmm. keep going you know that was detrimental to my state of being my health mm -hmm. what, mental what, spiritual everything yes yeah, what i know my body needed i i'm very into what my body wants and needs yeah yeah and the the climate up there was not for me mm -hmm. we were we were put in a tropical climate for a reason mm -hmm. as melanated carbonated people mm -hmm. so go back to your environment and you'll see a difference mm -hmm. your health mm -hmm. How you survive? You don't tell them your business, but generally, give a tell you, you you're surviving. Give a yeah. I, I planned for it. 
-hmm. from the time I left from the I was in New York for a month mm -hmm. I moved there in March of 82 by April of 82 sorry for the nice people sorry for the nice I just circle by April of 82 I told myself that I'm going back home and every decision that I made from that time on General. was to come back home I'm not going to go to my yet. Oh, sorry, I'm not going to violent. I joke, man. Go on. <laughs> go ahead, Lord, Lord, say it. Yeah, I went through college. I went through high school. I raised four handsome men. Mm -hmm. But in the back of my mind, everything, there was the plan. Every choice I made was to be able to come back to Jamaica. How about safety? You, you're, you're a woman trading alone. What, 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 you, what you think? What safety? How do you feel about that? With all the crime reporting, how do you survive? What crime? <laughs> no, I mean, it's real. We can't ignore the, the crime is real, yes. But everybody knows and understands that you, you, you live in a certain area and you know the pockets of those areas that are crime crime field. Mm -hmm. You Not recommend a, a housing scheme for people? If that's what you want. If that's what if if that's where you're comfortable, yes. I'm not comfortable in a housing scheme. I'm more comfortable on a farm. Mm -hmm. Acres. Secluded mm -hmm. on a farm. That's where I'm more comfortable. Mm -hmm. But some people could be comfortable. So you plan to define defend yourself, karate, chai and some weaponry. Listen, I plan to just wake up and live. Oh! <laughs> and the music you have follow. Wake up I'm, and live. I'm just gonna wake up and live. Mm -hmm. You know? What mm -hmm. is my destiny is my destiny. What is my fate is my fate. Mm -hmm. Good, good, good. I like that energy you have. Just live free, be free. Don't think about... Why live in fear? You, mm -hmm. we, we all know that we're gonna die somewhere, someday. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Some way, somehow. We never know how. Mm -hmm. Just live anyway. Yeah. Live the way you so want to So you don't think anyway. about no. what's happening around you. You just have a circle within yourself. Yeah. Yeah. For a whole year or so, I'm here on my own. Mm hmm Trotting all over the island. Mm hmm From St. Mary to Negril. From Negril to St. Elizabeth. You mm -hmm. know, from St. Elizabeth to Kingston. Mm -hmm. Back on, you know, I circle the whole island. Mm hmm I have no problems whatsoever. Mm -hmm. Because I don't look for it. Mm -hmm. And you don't get up in the morning, you have a positive disposition. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you like eating when you're in, now that you're in the tropical, what, what is your thing now? Fish, pumpkin, fish, pumpkin, fish, pumpkin. Yeah? <laughs> and now bulga. Yeah. I've, I've been reintrodu reintroduced to bulga. I haven't had bulga since I left in the 80s. Fish and pumpkin. Fish pumpkin. Add chocho favorites. to it. Mm, yeah, I like chocho, but I haven't had any chocho since I came back. What and do you I, think? And of then I juice every morning. Or you juice? Juice, um, whatever is in season. Right now, thank goodness, mango is back in season. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, mango, pineapple, a watermelon, kneesberry when it's in season, plums when it's in season, sour sap, sweet sap. Just a combination of any of what I have. Mm -hmm. And I juice it and drink it every morning. Mm -hmm. And the, um, all the, uh, the, the pectins and the chemicals and the juices keep you so young and fresh. You know what I mean? It just keeps you, and it keeps you vital yeah. all day long. Some of the dislikes, I'm going to go and do another interview with you, same one, with less noise, you know? Mm. Keep this vibration going, but tomorrow's not promised, so we'll have to do it right mm. now. Mm. Now, what are some of the things you don't like that, that you miss about the state? <laughs> <laughs> service, customer service. No, absolutely nothing. <laughs> Customer Be service? You know why not even customer service? Because you just slow down. I came to Jamaica knowing that that's how it is. Mm -hmm. And I cannot 
I'm not gonna try to change or get frustrated about something that I cannot change. Mm -hmm. You know, so mm -hmm. you just live with it. You just live with it. You know, you call. Basically, when I go in to a government, I give them, I greet them with a smile. Hi. Yeah. How are you? Yeah. And that makes a world of a difference mm -hmm. on how they treat you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean. Mm -hmm. So that's how I combat that. You light up the place. I light it up when I go in, and and they're okay. And you try to and go early, 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 because you know what I'm saying. No, I'm not an early morning. You can oh, okay. do that. I don't. Some I'm not an early morning person. So if you go Jamaica, if you go some place and you don't go early, like the tax office. Mm-hmm. Line long. I know. I have my chair in my car. Okay, okay. My, See? I have my portable chair. Easy. I have your book for it. So you don't, a, and I sit on You yeah. don't care, so you have a put it, you recommend. Listen, I have no care in the world. Yeah. Except to breathe and enjoy this life. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Enjoy. Enjoy what you, you, you retire. so much to offer. Yes. Mm. So there's no need to hear, so I rush. Mm -mm. No rush. No rush. I'm there. I'm there. I, I know how the government agencies work here in Jamaica. And so when I get up and I say I'm going to the registrar's office, I know that it's going to be probably a three, four hour thing, especially the banks. <laughs> right? <laughs> I know it's going to be a three, four hour thing. I have my, 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 my chair and I have my phone. I can listen to my podcasts or whatever. Your umbrella Probably too. even listen to YouTube. Your umbrella. Uh huh. I have my headset, I have my umbrella, and um, I sit and wait. I'm not in any rush. I'm not gonna put any, any anxiety over something that I can't control. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. Mm -hmm. So you just deal with it. And what's your favorite place so far in Jamaica? Always and forever, the grill. For now, the grill. Until Why? until I start. Why um, the grill? I just I just love the the beach, but now I'm ex now I'm exploring Jamaica a little bit more. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm finding solace in the mountains as well. Mm -hmm. So you know, Negro might have to be bumped a little bit, yeah. Because I uh, I went to that um that retreat in Portland and oh, that was amazing. Jamaica Good Life sent you there. Cheers. Say. Good life. <laughs> Water beside the the um a river runs right through it oh my it was amazing it was amazing what was amazing about it <sighs> nature and her sounds and her her abundance was amplified mm -hmm. you know what i mean mm -hmm. just everything was everything was the air was crisp so you went into the program of life because mm -hmm. you have to go into the ocean for that you know and then you have to go down the mountains for that. Yeah. Two places really in the ocean and yeah, in the mountains. mountains. Way up in the mountains. And I yearn for that again. That experience. That experience. Again. I, I yearn, I, the, 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 the darkness that, that the night produced was... There, there was some kind of therapy in that darkness. I, I can't explain it, but I've never ever been mm -hmm. by myself in such darkness in my life. And never felt any kind of fear, fear. or any, you know. You made the, a transition. I slept well. Mm -hmm. You know what I in mean. In the mountains by yourself. In the mountains. So by a woman myself. can do it. Mm. What did your family say? To um, Jamaica good life mad. No sir, no sir. <laughs> Some, you know, there was who whosoever had anything to say that was negative, mm -hmm. uh, cut them off and mm -hmm. later. Mm -hmm. You know, we call when we come. Yeah, transition. When I, when I, what are some of the negative things you see here? When you do these kind of things. Oh, you're up there by yourself. They ain't gonna come in and broke down the and kill you. Um, whatever animal, I don't know what animal they're talking about. Maybe bugs, I don't know. I didn't see any animal, no, nothing, nothing. I didn't see any bugs, I didn't see any centipedes. I, I saw maybe a couple of lizards and you know, uh -huh. the spider, but they were part and they, the, we, we share the environment together. A real retreat. You know what I mean? Do you feel a little bit more healed that you made that journey? Oh, definitely. So now that's your spot. That's my spot. You got the connection. Yeah. There's always I, a I, I was tapped into, I yeah. was tapped in 
completely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. People, my members of Jamaica Good Life, my number is 646 330 My members, my VIPs. A lot of connections to be had. It's been a journey, and we're not touched the islands yet. Yeah. I've been working on the health box, taking care of my own health. The reason why I've been doing a lot of videos, my health was being challenged because I've been traveling and I'm eating every and everything. I developed pre-diabetes, I start getting big. And as I get older, I said, wait a minute, me can't I'm gonna do YouTube and destroy myself. Most of the chefs you will see online, you see them start getting fat. The rice, the cooked food, the mucus. So the change and balance where we practice is a must, you know, the almighty. We trust. This is Jamaica Good Life. We can't come last, I have to come first. This is Randy. And so big up to Sandy, come the girls. I'm coming. Queen! I'm going to buy some fish today. And we're going to have another sit down. And everything we eat them off. And no, this is the, the eating, talking. You know, we're not a cat. We have to find a cat. If we have this. One you think come. that we, well, we can't get this? I always attract cats. They will come. When will come? <laughs> <laughs> come, come. There's a dog. There, there's a dog. We can't get the dog them a truck, but the cat them won't truck, right? Them they born there. Them no, 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 no. <laughs> big fish that. We're going to bury them on the ground. You see me? Compost, yes. Yeah, man. So, compost. So, people, thank you for full join with us. Um, I'm 50 now, so I'm going to slow it down, speed it up a little. I was going to change our balance and hopefully I'll, we will be here, I'll be here, you'll be here for the next 50 years. So our 50-50 we say. Mm -hmm. Our 50-50 plan. Yeah, I gave the US 40 years of my life. I, would, I need to give Jamaica more than that. Wow, that's a good slogan. For put upon the next Jamaica Good Life t-shirt. Mm -hmm. And another thing I want to put upon the new t-shirt that will come out next time. Not today. <laughs> me not have nothing. <laughs> No means no. Yeah. <laughs> so when them say I come, I am not a bank. I create a whole new t-shirt line. Don't call me uncle. <laughs> Don't call me boss. <laughs> uh, me is a, a goat herder. I am a goat herder. <laughs> uh, Africa me I come from. Not far in. Enough things. Then just let me out today. <laughs> me just get deep. <laughs> <laughs> They just dip me. <laughs> oi! Oi! Don't watch the wallet. Watch the mind. Watch the heart. Don't watch the wallet. Enough t shirt line me I come out with you know. And one of them said, Don't antagonize me. You know? Let me tell you, this country is beautiful as a country. And the people are vibrant, but wise and self needing. We all say that that's what them say. They're calculating what them need and they're always in need. Some of them will give and share, but in their mind, they're trying to figure you out to see if you can buy them a dragon's top. That's what Jamaica is about. The brain of the Jamaicans are working over time. So when you touch down, all of a sudden, no problem arises. And the calculations start. What is the next chapter of your life to fuse with their life? What am I gonna get? When is the barrel coming? What's in the barrel? What do I put in my barrel for my fellow Jamaicans? Seasoned sardines are some of the nicest sardines in the state. No, you know, it's a barrel heavy and suitcase heavy. I share with my fellow Jamaicans, I love them. I go to five and below, I get some knives. Burlington Coat Factory, I get knives. Jamaicans have poor knives. So you can put a lot of knives in your suitcase. So when you meet them, you must give them a gift. Now in China, I shop for some things. From China, I ship it to my drop. And it comes to Jamaica, we'll teach you guys how to do that. But knives are great gifts. When you return as a return resident, if you bring 20 knives, you can't spend like 30 US dollars for that. And that's 20 people. And they will always remember you. 
So nothing is wrong with the gift giving process, but you know the weight and the cost, but you want to have a gift. And the greatest gift is to give someone in Jamaica is a knife, a good quality knife, because the knife here are very poor quality. And um, another great gift is headsets, like wireless Bluetooth headsets. They love that. And shades. They love the shades. They love the watches. So anything small, they can fit in your suitcase and they're over. And then you go to Burlington, you get shoes for $16 and stuff. My best place to bring gifts to Jamaica is Burlington Coat Factory. We can get good quality without the cost. So they put that in another barrel. You know what I said? So, how, how did I be, be safe? My share. What little I have. You know? And even the shirt off on my back. Enough people in Jamaica have I mean, literally have the shirt. You see me? Enough time I mean, leave clothes. I mean, all this. I love it. Jamaica is a sharing culture. You see, a lot of people think Jamaican people are just beggy beggy. No. You have to know them. You have to eat with them. You have to suffer with them. They have to know that so you don't have it and you're there on them and them for feed you at the for them time. You have to make them, you have to change them. So some when them when them are cook, make sure you're dead. Eh? <laughs> when they're not cook, make them feed you. You see me? So that way them see the balance. You see me? When you go out, bring your own thermos with your own soup. Don't go out to go buy food and a drive with people every day. Bring a sardine and, and a bread. I make them see I cut up the sardine with the red onion and they say, Why well, well, broke fine around there? I pay a sardine. No one on them money. Broke them bad. <laughs> well, I don't eat chicken. You know? I'm a Muslim, so I can't buy chicken for you because I go against my religion. <laughs> Cut out the sardine and make we eat that bread. You have to test them. Put a slice of bread in your backpack with some sardine. Yeah, okay. But I'm not eating sardine. No. Oh, too bad for you. Because that's all me eat. Sometimes you just drink your natural juice. Yo, I, I, I drink. I'm Muslim. We can't buy no drink. Turn Muslim on them. <laughs> it, it, it rough down here when it comes to calculation. You're a foreigner, so they expect your fee cater to their alcoholic needs you see what I'm saying? and if you buy good weed then you give them give to them or I like traveling to Bacala Rome because when you start by when when you go to the little shop where them gather you know and the shopkeeper know everybody keep the secret you know all of a sudden them are buy the dragon for 250 you reach there and a 400 you spend and then nobody now tell you say a uh, uh, 250 for the dragon. Can the shopkeeper just nod their head to the wall of them and then give them a cut when you're gone? So, them all work together. You spend 400 off your back, like dragon. And when you drink, yo, why tell you like the shop there, you know? <laughs> five, five, five thousand for the bill. One back of rum at three thousand. At a four stop on the way. So you get forced, come remember saying in Jamaica, every time you're stopping now, a three, five thousand dollars you have to spend now. Every time you see a human being, you have to let off something. So if you don't have the knife, man, you are a nice lighter from foreign or a belt or, or a nice purse, something. Money off a run. I don't do all of that. Because you not travel with people, me interact with people. So the amount of people me interact with, it costs me. So I have to know how to interact with people because the minute them see you, yes, good life. So I take out a sardine from season and say, boom! He said, the two sardines, when I get them and them taste it, them say, yes, good life. Because it tastes different. So you have a wise. The sardine, a lot of it can fit. And a good quality, I'm not talking about it. I'm not talking about some things. Mm -hmm. So at least me know I say we give them something. But me like myself and them no have. So Jamaicans just need something different. Even if it's a toothbrush. 
them won't bother, you know, them, them have everything down here, you know, and they have money, no and they have money. <laughs> and one thing I must understand is the Jamaican people, they have money. Because the whole of them part of partner draw, everybody have a susu, am I correct? Mm -hmm. Are you, I know them partner draw. <laughs> and, and to see them in the star, sitting in the Starbucks, the Starbucks was, and not even just, they were teenagers in there. Yeah, Starbucks. In Starbucks. KFC. Pizza Hut. The teenagers on the beach yesterday. KFC. KFC. Them save up their money. money. I'm good savers, man. I want them to make Jamaica people there. Them, they, they may have 10 million at the bank. You know, it's not going go on for me. Just forget for your mm -hmm. one. Yeah. Jano. So these things now for learn. It's a beautiful day. Time to go to the beach. My could just left them in the kitchen. When I wash the plate, I go straight to the beach.